Hey guys, so today I'm doing this grungy, smoked out taupe look featuring ColourPop eyeshadows from the fall collection. If you want to see how I did this look, then keep watching. So I'm starting off with some matte shades from the e.l.f. Mad for Matte eyeshadow palette and I'm taking a soft rosy color and just using this in the crease. I feel like when I use the ColourPop shadows I like to use regular eyeshadows, matte ones first. And then again I'm taking another matte shade which is a little bit warmer and just using this as my transition color. Moving on I'm going to take the shade Party Time and I'm going to work this in the outer and inner part of the eyelid and just blend this into the crease as well. I'm trying to avoid the center of my lid and you want to just keep blending and blending, taking a clean brush now and blending it out even more. I'm also applying that same color to the lower lash line and connecting the upper part with the lower lash line. Moving on, I'm taking Straight Trippin, which is another really dark matte shade, and I'm going to darken up the inner and outer corners again, placing it where I want to, and using a smaller brush to blend it out. You want to take your time with this and just add a little bit, blend it, and add a little bit, and then blend it. I'm taking the shade Plaid, which is this gorgeous sort of khaki green, and I'm going to do a wing on the lower lash line, and again leaving that space in the center, so I'm just winging it out. And I have to say, these shadows are awesome for like doing a winged liner. And also the inner corner as well. And then I'm taking mixed tape on my finger, and I'm going to apply this to the center of my lid where I left that blank space. And I feel like this goes on a lot better using your fingertips. And then I'm just using a brush to blend out any harsh edges. Next I'm taking a shimmery nude color. Any color will do. And I'm going to highlight the inner corners of my eyeballs. Next for the waterline I'm using this emerald green color from Jordana. It's called J Jewel. And I just really love how this went with the plaid shade from ColourPop. And again, I'm going back to mixed tape and applying that in the center on the lower lash line and blending it with my little pinky finger. Moving on, I'm going to apply some liquid liner and mascara. I'm doing a very, very thin line and I love this e.l.f. liquid liner because I can get a really precise, sharp edge. And I'm just creating another wing on top of the bottom wing. <laughs> And then just connecting the two, winging out girlfriend, and applying lots and lots of mascara. To finish off the face, I'm going to contour using my e.l.f. bronzer palette. And for a soft blush, I'm using this Jordana blush in Tawny Beige. Just applying this to my cheeks. And for highlighter today, I'm using the Mary Luminizer. I haven't used it in a while, so I thought, you know what? Let's glow it up. Glow them cheeks. And I did pop on some false lashes. To finish off this look, I'm going to use the Grunge Lip Liner and Lipstick again from ColourPop. I'm in love with this shade. It is so gorgeous. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this fall kind of smoky grunge taupe look. Uh, don't forget to check out the description bar where you can find me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed. All the products are linked down below in the description bar. And I will see you all in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.